Hello and welcome to this short video featuring some small corrections and additions to my previous episodes of Skyrim and Oblivion Cut content. These games ain't perfect and neither am I. No one is. But for the sake of my own credibility and to prevent my failures coming to haunt me in my sleep, let's address some small issues. In episode 5 of Skyrim Cut content, Dawnguard Docking, I talked about how the Dawnguard DLC added an unused map marker for the Windhelm Docks. But I completely failed to mention that an unused marker is also added for the Dawnstar docks. Oh, and it's even incorrectly marked as a shipwreck too, just like Windhelms. How nice of Bethesda to keep their bugs consistent. When making the episode, I even checked for unused markers there. But apparently I missed it. Next, in episode 19, Vigilant Tolan, I stated that Vigilant Tolan is never mentioned again after the quest A New Order. That's not entirely true either, as Tolan actually has some more unused dialogue. Namely, his reaction to the idea of seeking out Florentius Banius, which is related to the quest bolstering the ranks. Florentius? Really? I assumed Isran would want nothing to do with him. Isran has a problem with most people, if you haven't yet noticed. No, this was different. He never trusted Florentius. Always thought him to be trying to get attention. I can't imagine that opinion has changed. Florentius still worked with the Order from time to time. Last I knew, he was headed to Runevald. But then, we hadn't heard from anyone there in a few weeks. If he's moved on, perhaps the Vigilance there can tell you where he's gone. In episode 22, Female Elder Hairstyles, I only looked at the unused models for the hairstyles. But I had no idea that those models shared the same hair texture as all the other hairstyles in Skyrim. So now you can see what those hairstyles were supposed to look like, with textures. And finally, in my video Oblivion Cut Content 3, Early Sith Topics, I stated that the Early Sith Topics were either removed due to being too samey feeling or because they took up too much disk space. Little did I know at the time that I actually already knew the answer to that. In this short script called NQD Anvil NPC script, we can see a variable that is commented out related to Duma Nigeric's Early City Topic. Next to it we can find a note reading Feature Deleted when voice files were reduced. So it seems very likely that the early city topics were indeed removed because there were just too many. I had a screenshot of this script since 2018, but I completely forgot of its existence. Oh well, I'm happy to have cleared some of this stuff up and I will hopefully see you in the future.